we are aware of SAS rule of congruency. Let's solve a problem based on SAS rule of congruency. So here is our problem. Arrive the congruency relation between the two triangles here and using the congruency relation prove that angle ACB is equal to angle QPR. So here we have two triangles and in these two triangles side AB is equal to side QR is equal to 7 centimeters. Side BC is equal to side PQ is equal to 8 centimeters. And the included angle, angle ABC is equal to included angle PQR is equal to 40 degrees. Let's discuss the approach for solving this. For solving this question, first we will look at the given data. From the given data, we will prove that the two triangles are congruent by SAS relation. And then by using CPCT, that means corresponding parts of congruent triangles, we will prove that angle ACB is equal to angle QPR. Let's see what is the given data here. Here we are given AB is equal to QR is equal to 7 centimeters. BC is equal to PQ is equal to 8 centimeters. And angle ABC is given equal to angle PQR is equal to 40 degrees. So here we can see we are given two pairs of sides as equal and the included angle between them is also equal. So by SAS rule we can say that triangle ABC is congruent to triangle RQP Now by CPCT, vertex angle at C should be equal to vertex angle at P and vertex angle at C is angle ACB and vertex angle at P is angle QPR. So this is what we had to prove in this question. Let's summarize what we have learned from this question. We learned how to apply SAS rule. We learned how to form congruence relationship. And then we learned how to infer data based on congruence relationship. We inferred that angle ACB is equal to angle QPR after establishing congruence of the two triangles.